When did you lose your virginity? Weirdest place you've had sex. Have you ever thought about each other in a romantic way? Have you farted really loud during sex? Why did your last relationship end? Shit! That's good, that's good! <laughs> Hi guys, welcome to or back to my channel if you are new here. My name is Joy and this is Jarvis you I feel all like, know. Yeah, you guys all know. I asked you guys questions on my Instagram, which I'll leave here on the screen I'll also leave Jarvis's Here on the screen and they're always linked below. Do We're you gonna shot it. We and have say it. Shit, shot it I'm gonna say <laughs> I'm already, it. Like, drunk. I haven't drunk anything. It's from sniffing it. You took a sniff before. I'm still recovering from the last party where I drank. Yeah. And you and drank, I drank yesterday. Last night, yeah. So <laughs> we're gonna try to be honest with these questions, but like you guys went pretty ham. Do like very little. Little. <laughs> little. I don't want to drink though. No, let's do that's, a proper. That's good. That's good. We'll do for the first one. A proper goodish one. For the first. Yeah. And then we'll. I'm not psychotic. I'm not feeling it the whole way. Because we're just going to be alone watching the Queen's Gambit after this, <laughs> so like... <laughs> just watching the computer screen dizzy as hell. First question. Weirdest place you've had sex? Do you want to start with that one, Javi? <laughs> Probably school. Yeah, I'm the same. Did you have sex at school too? <laughs> yeah. In the car park. Oh my god. Oh, really? Where did you... Oh, in the loft. In the room. <laughs> Yeah, that would be my weirdest place so as well. Both school. Which is not that exciting, honestly. I think. <laughs> I think it's pretty weird. At school? Mm. I guess most people wouldn't. I guess for our school, it's not that weird. I don't know. But mine was yeah. after hours. Was yours after hours? Yeah. Okay, yeah. yeah. It wasn't during school, no, guys. Not during school. Have you ever had a proper crush or hots for someone's parents? <laughs> Javi? <laughs> <laughs> I've definitely thought like, oh, that parent is like an attractive adult, but I've never like had. The I wouldn't hots. say I wouldn't say I've had a crush on a parent. Mm. I would say no. Okay. I genuinely, yeah. I, I genuinely. No. <laughs> I, I am genuine. <laughs> Have you farted really loud during sex? <laughs> no. <laughs> Have you? No, but like I've definitely. It's <laughs> a pretty bad. What are they called? Creeps. <laughs> I hate yeah. that word. So I much. hate that word so much. Oh. But like, I'd be lying if I <clears throat> said I hadn't had some pretty. Well, I feel like in certain positions, just air like gets happens. up in there. Yeah, but it's I not like, like a fart. Goes. It's just like air release. Like a release. Your body's but releasing. it's pretty awkward when you're like having sex and it's like. <laughs> and you're like I swear. <laughs> Do you watch porn? What? Mm. <laughs> what? Yeah. Yeah. Very rarely. Um, no, I don't really. I have obviously in the past to like check it out. The thing is, I just find it really hard to find ones that actually turn me on and are good. Like, yeah. I, so oh, by yeah. the time I find one, I'm just <coughs> like, no. <laughs> when did you last and last paint? <laughs> I'm taking a shot. I'm gonna take the shot. I'm just gonna take the shot. <laughs> Cheers. Name at least one high school crush you had that was a secret. One high school crush that was a secret. <laughs> Do you need to shut this one, Jowie? Um, oh, this is weird if they watch it though. Are you gonna answer it? Well, I just don't have, I don't, I can't think of any crushes I had that like weren't, um, I can definitely think of one. Oh, really? Yeah. Obviously, I had crushes on little people, but like it was like little for weeks. People. <laughs> I had a crush, um, like little crushes on people, but like. Okay, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna say, okay. I, I had a secret crush on Oceana. Really? Yeah. What year? Year twelve. Mm. <laughs> Worst trait about each other. Shit. <laughs> That's a terrible question. I think it's like for you. Sometimes you're just so relaxed <laughs> that you like forget to tell me stuff that for me is like very important, but for you yeah. it's like little details, yeah. you know. It's like directions to like. Yeah. Uh, you like, you'll get there, it's just through the bush. Just down the road. Just down the road. I'm like, no, job, just send me the fucking address. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> so that would probably yeah, be no. yours. I, I take that. This kind of goes hand in hand with what you... You said? Kinda, the opposite? Kinda, no. What's really, like, sometimes like, whew, is you always want to do something. True. 
it's like if we're gonna hang out, we're gonna go to like a cafe and eat. Yeah. And I'm like, we're all broke. Yeah. Right? <laughs> yeah. No, but I think it's. I think we need one person like that in the friend group. I agree. <laughs> I'll otherwise, take we, on that otherwise we won't do anything. Exactly. We'll just sit around. Like every time we like go out to dinner or something, it's usually. Like, it's very special. Yeah. Have you ever had like a sexy dream that involved the other? So like a sexy oh. dream about. Listen, I've had a lot of sexy dreams about a lot of guy friends because you can't mm -hmm. control it. I, however, don't remember having a sexy dream about you, but I, I yeah. feel like I would have had one. I've definitely had dreams about you, but I don't think they're sexy. Yeah. Next question is body count. Yeah. Cheers. Absolutely. <laughs> Have you ever thought about each other in a romantic way? I think we can answer this at the same time. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> <laughs> Did you ever have a moment in high school? When I first came, yes. Really? I would say yeah. You were like my first kind of crush. Stop. I would say. Really? Yeah. yeah. That is so flattering because Jarvis came to school and literally every girl was obsessed with him instantly. <laughs> no. So like the fact that that's so interesting. Yeah. I definitely thought you were attractive, but all my friends were into you, so I was like, oh, yeah. oh, oh. you've always had seven hundred boyfriends. So. Oh shut <laughs> up. No, you've always had long term relationships. Yeah, kind of. Um kind of. <laughs> <laughs> Did either of you guys want to be more than just friends at any time in your life? No. Well, I feel like I answered that last time. But you Having a crush doesn't mean you were like, I want to be more than... Did you ever well, be like... Well, we weren't even friends. Exactly. So you so weren't like, I want to like, be... Wow, like... that would be cute. Aww. Oh, but then... <laughs> This little, 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 little one. Um, first kiss story. Mine was with Ruben. Shout out to you, Ruben. <laughs> Shout out to Ruben. <laughs> um, it was like in year... Nine? I had my... First kiss pretty late on. And yeah, we were at school. <laughs> really? Yeah. We went to like the primary school area and just sat on this bench under a tree. I kissed him. And he was like, Ugh. he was so taken back. Did you kiss him? Yeah. Like, excluding kindergarten first, like, mm. kind of real kiss would probably be Bella. <laughs> um, in year seven, when I used to go to Southern Cross, me and Morkai. We're best friends and we were dating two best friends and oh, it, was, that's really it was so cute. cute. Would you ever consider getting together? P.S. I love you. <laughs> yes. <laughs> what is your I love you. I L Y and I uh. <laughs> myself to word that. Consider. No. No. Unless we felt manly manly in love. Manly. I can't speak. <laughs> This video is already going bad. Unless we fell madly in love with each other, then no, obviously not. What? Not worth. Bro, I don't plan to get together with anyone <laughs> right now. <laughs> really? Not yet. Lies, actually. Lies. <laughs> I lie. I lie. Why did your last relationship end? <laughs> Fucking hell. Um, mine was I just needed to be single. I think I mentioned it even in my Q and A. Like we had a lot of growth to do individually and I just realized that I needed to focus on myself and work on myself and I needed to um, grow my own self-love in order to feel like I can give the love that I would want my partner to get from me. Yeah? You got it? I got it. Sweet. <laughs> I'm gonna shot. <laughs> Cheers, honey. Are oh, you bye? I've thought about this. A mm. lot. Me really? and the boys. Okay. Me and the boys. <laughs> no, me and like my male friends, we always think talk about, about it. it. And talk about it. We we are very touchy feely like. All the boys group. are very touchy. Yeah. yeah. I mean the whole friend group is very touchy, but I guess it's quite rare for like guys on and guys. Guys on guys. Guys, on guys. <laughs> yeah. guys and guys to be touchy in the way that you guys are. Like, I thought yeah, I thought a fair bit mm. and because like you always do, every guy will be like, Am I? Yeah. Am I bro? Yeah. And then you know, you, it's pretty easy to determine what you are if you like put it to the test. <laughs> Just Actually like even try. from like hugging and like kissing my guy friends, <laughs> yeah. I can tell yeah, that like, I am a hundred percent not. It's not for me. Yeah. It's not for me. I'm exactly the same. I've just never been sexually attracted to a girl, but I'm obviously, I'm 20 and I'm open to, like maybe one day I will see a girl and be like, fuck, I mm. love you. Like who knows? But at this point, 
Yeah, I've only ever been attracted to guys. When did you lose your virginity? 16. 16. What's the craziest thing you've done for a crush? For a crush? Yeah. I haven't done much crazy things for a crush apart from my first crush ever. Shout out to Marco. Lots of shout outs in this video. <laughs> shout out to Marco in year one. I gave him all my crystals and thought that would make him fall in love with me. And he just took the crystals and went. <laughs> Marco! Like, I'm still heartbroken, Marco. Did you get them back? No! And I was like, Marco! It was a full crystal collection. I'm kind of shocked because, yeah. Really? Job. Yeah. Okay, next question. Have you guys ever kissed or hooked up? No. One. Oh, I was gonna say one. <laughs> <two, three>. One. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, let's go again. Ready? One, one two, two, three. three. No. no. We're we tell you guys the truth. We literally Me have never. Lying. Like we haven't even like had a drunk kiss ever. Yeah. I don't really drunk kiss. I don't think I've ever had a drunk kiss anyone. Really, job. Think about that one. Yeah, I'm gonna take that <laughs> probably right back. <laughs> first impression. What the okay. hell does that mean? Our first impressions of each other. Oh, I thought you were gorgeous. Oh. I could I could kind of tell that you weren't just Australian, which <laughs> <laughs> kind of made me more attractive because oh. I don't know. I just I was just like it seems like a cool kind of. Person, not exotic. Uh, <laughs> I'm fucking exotic. I don't know. Can it just like from cash? everyone's from everyone's perspective on you, I kind of figured that you were like a similar like family person, loving and just Aww. I don't know. Everyone didn't look at you with a bad shade. So I was like, huh. That's so nice. I thought you were, yeah, I thought you were really attractive. Funny story. So you came to this <laughs> yeah. you came to the school, right? And like a bunch of, he came in your tent, so like a bunch of new kids came to school at the same time. Went to Greece, came back and you had like kind of very much become a part of my friend group. So mm. we kind of like started hanging out at lunch and stuff. And I remember just complimenting. I just thought, I looked at Jarvis one time and I looked in his eyes and I was like, fuck, he's very handsome. So I was like, I literally just was like, you're really good looking. And Jarvis just went, thanks. <laughs> Well, that's why, I, and I thought you didn't like me. That's why it's so shocking for yeah. me to, for you to say no. like you, you like thought I was cool or like pretty or whatever. One, I wore a bucket hat when I first came, so I was <laughs> oh not God. cool. I forgot about the hat. Two, boys don't know how to accept compliments that well in this day and age. And that's true. Three, I I just moved to a new school and I was very very nervous. That's true. For me, it was more so like I was just like you're very attractive, and all my girlfriends were like, oh my God. So I was like, I'm just gonna be straight up and tell you. You're yeah. fucking beautiful. And you were like, yeah, cheers, babe. Cheers. No, not even babe. Thanks. <laughs> well, <laughs> Thanks. I'm sorry. Thank it's you. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. Have you ever checked each other out secretly? What does that mean? What do you mean, what does that mean? Have you ever checked each other out? Like, like online? <laughs> sorry, the tequila is getting to me, bro. Like, just have you ever like checked each other, like looked at each other in real life? Yes. I, yeah, definitely. Yes. How can you 100%. not? You literally check out, ev like I check out all my friends. It's not in a weird way, it's just humans are curious. Yeah, we're curious animals. <laughs> we're seeing <laughs> what's out there. Exactly. So yes, definitely yeah, check you out. Yeah, absolutely. This is glue by the way, it's not something <laughs> weird, it's Sikaflex. I've been Sikaflex, it's things. silicone. 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 Have you ever seen each other naked? No. 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 I don't think so. I'm this. I'm this. <laughs> Sub or dom? Like submissive or dominant? What are you doing, you weirdo? Um, <laughs> submissive or dominant? Yeah. I've genuinely been in a blend. Of in it. a blend. I think if I was more one, it would be submissive. Mm. But I think also certain relationships bring out certain dynamics. Yeah. No more shots. <laughs> I'm just gonna answer everything. <laughs> <laughs> I was not expecting to answer that. Um, yeah. <laughs> was there a time period in your life that you felt really self-conscious about your body? Yes. I think, actually, this year I've gone through a really big um, experience with my body. I went through a lot of health issues and I kind of, my body changed for the first time in a really long time. Didn't feel like it was 
what I wanted it to be. Mm. And then I just, suddenly something changed and I was like, fuck, you know, like whatever my body is, it's working and it's beautiful and I love it and I'm taking mm. care of it. I think as soon as the health issues started getting better, I just was able to like accept my body for what it is. Yeah. And I think now I actually feel the most confident I've ever felt in my body because I really just see it as like a vessel, you know, it's like, I love you. Like you're doing so well. Good job. I think especially when I first came to Shearwater. Mm. Um, from my last school I kind of felt it just from the I don't know public schools are just weird man but yeah, yeah like I definitely about like my weight and I don't know the way my body is just like is just made I don't know like I, I have a big nose because I'm Aboriginal and me and my siblings get like we got big chins and stuff but like see I don't even think that yeah. you but like I told you like literally you're so attractive. That's it's so crazy that people like think about these things, and you're like, yeah. no, but that's what makes you so you yeah. and, like so beautiful. Yeah, and like I've I've come to terms with like I don't give a sh as long as I'm healthy. That's yeah. my main thing. Is as as long as I'm actually like physically capable, 100%. I'm a hundred percent all okay with the being, way your body looks. Yeah, yeah. being the exactly. way I am. Have you ever kissed two people in one night? I don't think I have. I feel like you have. <laughs> Thanks. Have you not? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> See? Any stories about getting friend zoned in the past? I left a message on a girl's phone once and she never replied, so. Bitch. Thanks. <laughs> um, she was actually really cute and really? cool. Really? Oh. That's okay. And that was recent, so. Really? <laughs> yeah. Have I not heard about this? Yeah. We'll have a chat after. Yeah. Um, I don't have any like strong memories of being friend zoned. If someone's not interested in me, then I'm just not gonna make a move. Have you ever said I love you to someone without really meaning it? <laughs> Yeah, I say I love yeah. you to Jarvis all the time and... I never mean it. <laughs> never. <laughs> never meant it once. No, um... <laughs> fucking hate you. You don't lose anything from telling people you love them. Whether it's yeah, like don't. strong or not. Yeah. There's just different levels of love. And I think when you really love someone, you can just tell. When you say it in a certain way, you're like, Oh yeah. I love you. And, and you're both and like... And it, it is for you as well. <laughs> like if you really love someone and it's like maybe the first time you've ever said I love mm -hmm. you, you can it's tell. It's so special. You can, it I, just, you do you feel remember it, the first time someone told you, or you told someone that you loved them? Yeah, it's like yes. it's neck level. Would you skinny dip together? Like, yeah, if the opportunity yeah, would arise, like skinny whatever. Skinny dipping's mad. <laughs> skinny dipping's fun. <laughs> rad. It's so <laughs> it's like cool, a mad dude. red. Sorry, the tequila's really kicky. <laughs> it's quite it's solid. so tight. <laughs> Has anyone walked in and you're having sex? Yes. <laughs> Didn't even have to finish the question. <laughs> so I was, yeah, partaking. And partaking? In my, in my old room, my old house, right? And my my uncle just walked in. Oh no. Like my uncle's my guardian, but he he walked in and it was pitch black and I was like, oh, hello, we're in here. And he walks in and he was like, yo, did you take my charger? And I was like, I'm going no, I did not take your charger. And he's like, you sure? Because mine's missing and it's, it's not in my room. You sure it's not in it? And I was like, I'm going I don't have your fucking charger. And he did not leave for like a minute because he was like, oh, bloody kids taking my chargers. And I was like, <laughs> with someone in the room, pitch black. And I was like, this is just, I'm so sorry. Oh, yeah. yeah. See, I've never had someone walk in on me like during, but <laughs> my brother walk in like just as it was beginning and the, like the clothes were coming up <laughs> and it was oh, so no. funny yeah. actually, i actually don't know if i've ever talked to my brother about that <laughs> sorry <Ed. laughs> it would have been pretty scary <laughs> if you weren't friends and met each other at a party would you find each other attractive and or consider kissing yeah yeah of course i still think you're attractive same yeah 100 percent. it's not like no. now that i know you i, I know yeah. you ever had a sex dream with the same gender i actually have I remember, and it was like, I woke up and I was like, huh, that was interesting. <laughs> Probably not something I want to partake in in real life, but <laughs> we keep saying partake. I have not. Participate. I have not had a sex dream with the same gender. Who's hotter? <laughs> <laughs> what kind of question is that? 21, 2, 
three. You. Me. <laughs> I thought that was, I was hoping you would say you. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, I honestly do think um, Jarvis is hotter. You're but... full of shit. No, I genuinely do think you're hotter. Not in a like self deprecating, I just think you were nah. born with very beautiful features. I think you just have really good genetics. So do you. Yeah. <laughs> What do you mean? You're so hot! You're fucking gorgeous! <laughs> do you think you met your soulmates? Yes. Whoa! So, <laughs> I really answered that fast. <laughs> so much confidence! <laughs> what do you mean? How do I not know this? I think I definitely have. <coughs> oh! Oh! <laughs> Maybe I have met my soulmate, but I don't know it. I think you, I think you know it. What do you mean? No, like, I think when you, like, you have to know it. At what age did you first get drunk? Mm. 13. Um, 12. I, mine was pretty late. Mine was, like, 16. You don't get drunk. I don't. I yeah. hardly ever drink, <laughs> truly, which just seems so contradictory. <laughs> this, but this is rare. It's true. Like, it is really rare. Like, you've never seen me drunk. No, I would really like you. I really I like, like you. I really like you. I would really <laughs> like to. <laughs> If you met the right person tomorrow, would you get in a relationship with them? I honestly think I would. <coughs> and that's big for me to say because I feel like for the past year, if I'm, I always thought like if the right person was right in front of me now, I just still wouldn't be ready to be in a relationship with them. Yeah. But I honestly am kind of open to it now. <gasps> I'm so, <laughs> so ready. I just fall in love again. Yeah. Yeah. True. I so want it. I know. I've been really thinking about it recently. I've been like, mm. oh. I miss just having like a one person. Yeah, just like, oh. Yeah. The good and the bad times. Yeah. Are you speaking to any guys slash girls right now? No. I want to take a shot. Oh, do I really don't want to. Ooh. Just take the shot. <laughs> well, that obviously means, yeah. <laughs> No, that doesn't mean anything. Um, will you ever get a tattoo? This yes. This is the last question. Oh, wow, okay. 100%. I actually have a tattoo voucher that I got for my 20th. Really? Yeah. I want to get a tattoo here of pippies because pippies are my totem. What are pippies? Pippies are the little shells that you find on the beach and oh, they dig in the sand. They're like triangles. Oh, cute. <clears throat> that's what I am. That's really cute. A digger. Oh, and that's your totem animal. Yeah. Wow, that's beautiful. Which is, no, it's not. <laughs> my what? sister is a whale, and my brother's a turtle, and my cousin's an eagle, and, so and I'm a shell. Oh. <gasps> How do you find out what your totem animal is? <clears throat> um, you have to get it from an elder. Wow. I got mine when I was a baby. What was the question? Would you ever get a tattoo? No, I don't think I could. I've never had a tattoo that I've been like, I want that on me for the rest of my life. And I change so much that I just feel like I just, mm. I just couldn't commit. That's it. That's it. <laughs> Good Thank stuff. You. Thanks for coming on the channel again. I should have done the disclaimer at the beginning, but like, we're not promoting drinking, obviously. Please yes. drink responsibly. We're also of age and we're doing this. Yeah, also we're definitely of age. We're thanks. definitely of age, guys. Be responsible. Yeah. That's it. Be responsible and take care of yourselves and may... F the Sorry. fourth be with May you. May the fourth be with you. The fourth of... <laughs> July. July. For Americans. For Americans. <laughs> Happy Independence Day. <laughs>